Hello, Relentless family. I am Pastor Robert Gray. I am the Director of Pastoral Care here at Relentless Church. I'm here to congratulate each one of you. Day 21 of the fast is here. I want to rejoice with you about being a part of this fast and also praying and believing that God is going to answer your prayers for so many things that you prayed for along the way. But I want to encourage you that if your prayer has not been answered at this point, please do not give up. Do not falter. As you look at the fact that when Jesus was in the wilderness, at the end of his fast when the temptations came, and there's so many times that when we're believing for something, we're fasting and we're praying, at the end of the fast, the enemy brings things against us. Please do not be discouraged by that. Just hang on, stand firm on his word. I remember one of Pastor John's powerful messages, which there are so many, but the one that sticks out to me, especially during this time of fast, is when Pastor John said that we as, as believers or in anyone who say at the beginning of the year, this is our season. And he said, no, it's not our season, it's God's season. This time of what we consider isolation, this time of this pandemic has put us in a position to seek God or to be able to sit still and listen to him. During this time of fasting, the one thing that I have learned and been a part of is the fact to understand that God responds to our obedience. Our obedience to take this time and to fast and allow him to speak to us is paramount in understanding what God is trying to say to us. So I want to encourage you that on this 21st day, if you have not received the answer, don't get discouraged. Please don't get discouraged. God is not mocked. Whatever we sow, we will reap. As we have sown this time of fasting and praying and believing and standing on his word, as I'm thinking about the fast, I'm reminded in the book of Daniel, as Daniel was praying and the angel reached him, he said on the first day, the first day that you prayed, your prayer was answered, your prayer was heard. But the enemy came in and hindered him and it took 21 days for him to get there. So I wanna encourage each of you as you have prayed from day one to now to continue to believe that your prayers were answered. But I also want to encourage you that do not allow the 21 day just to be for the 21 days. This to be a lifestyle going forward, to continue to fast, to pray and believe. And I truly, truly believe that as all of us who are praying and believing, God is going to answer each one of our prayers. God says in his word in Ephesians 3.20 that he would do exceedingly abundantly above all that we can ask according to his purpose. Stand on that word, exceedingly and abundantly above all that we can ask. I truly believe that we have not seen or heard all the things that he's gonna do for us. I believe going forward, starting this year, that we will see things we have not seen. We will hear things we have not heard. And just remember that he responds to our obedience. So be encouraged. This house, our pastors, Pastor John and Aventer, loves us so much. And they care about us so much. They want the best for us. So finally, I would like to personally thank Pastor John and Aventer Gray for their leadership, thanking them for answering the call to come here. I thank them for Relentless. I thank you that that name Relentless is a very powerful name that causes us who are part of this ministry to be relentless in our pursuit of God and pursuit of the things that he has called us to do. So I thank you for being here, being a part of this ministry. So let us pray. Father, I thank you always that you always hear my prayer. I thank you, Father God, for this day. I thank you, Father God, that you have brought us through this year of 2020, through the pandemic, through this COVID-19. 
So many people have lost their lives. But Father, we thank you that we are still here. And you have brought us to this new year of 2021. And as we go forward through this year, Father, we thank you, Father God, that this year will be a year like no other, that you're going to bring so many things to us to show us your power. And we bind the enemy. We declare right now in the name of Jesus that no weapon formed against us will prosper. And we thank you, Father God, that you will get all the praise and all the glory and all the honor. In the name of your son, Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen.